Packing to go to Haleakala now. Oh. Gotta get out the door, getting yelled at. Alright, gotta rush. Bye. So it is 3.05 a.m. and we are on our way to Haleakala Sunrise. As you can see, it's still quite dark. I can see the light. Despite about four hours of sleep, I think we're feeling pretty good, pretty excited. Um, and now we have a little light because there's someone behind us blaring their uh, headlights at us. So that's nice. Haleakala. A little ways less to go, like five miles, but these people will not drive the speed limit, which makes us a little bit worried. I give my life, I give it all for the look, for the call. All right, what's going on, guys? Here at Haleakala, sunrise using the GH5 Wi-Fi app. Get some awesome images. I don't know if you can stand to see me shivering from over there, but yeah, it's cool. On our way up to the next lookout, we drove to the top of the other one, which was the highest point we could get to. Now this one is a hike up, and it's uh, it's about the same height, but you know, coming up before sunrise, couldn't see much of anything, and therefore had no idea which way to go, where would be the best place to go. And because it was so cold, my nose is running. There was also a peeing situation. It was such a, it was a long drive, and there were like no bathrooms. Look out for nanes. <laughs> Look out for nanes. Gotta watch out for nanes on the driving. Is that even. You think that's what it says? Nene? N Nini? 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 Slow down Nene? for Nini. Slow down for Nini or Nene? You can hold this higher up. So we're, we just saw the sunset because that's clearly what I say every <laughs> single time. The sunrise, it was gorgeous. It was Definitely amazing with <laughs> I changed, did I, the amazing is amazing. the word. Amazing is the word. Amazing is the word I use for everything because it's amazing. Uh, fluffy, cloudy goodness. Um, we definitely need to go find more coffee since we had to get in the car <laughs> by 2.30 a.m. this morning. Totally. Some of the most beautiful colors as the sun was coming up. It just slowly, slowly came up. And then as the sun came up, it came up real quick. So, like, you can miss it. It was pr probably from starting to see... The little bit, littlest bit of the sun to the full sun was like 10 to 15 minutes tops. You got to get up here in time. If, you, if you're planning ever a trip to Maui, you got to make sure you get up here. But look at that view behind us. It's gorgeous. It's just gorgeous coming up here. Totally worth it. We got we got lucky. We got a free day. This was like free no day. like no charge day, no charge Saturday but or something. But make sure they you have it. your reservation yes. for your car, or else they'll turn you around at the gate. Yes, we had somebody in front of us when we were coming up. Long drive up. Plan like depending on where you are. Plan a lot of time to get up here. Um, Two so, hours from Lahaina. Yeah. So there were there were people coming up. And some people were just driving super, super slow. I guess because the road is so windy, there's not really side rails or gates or anything to protect you from falling off. And, and it's dark. And it's dark. And so people were driving like slower than the speed limit, which is 25, 15 in, in turns. So be prepared to get stuck behind some slow, slow drivers. And then if you don't come up with your reservation, they will turn you around. And that's easy. You just go online. Uh, you fill out, some, fill out a, a quick form and they send you... Uh, an email with your reservation yeah. real quick. Uh, I, I'd say just Google ha Haleakala, uh, Hawaii and Maui or whatever, and it comes up. I forget how I did it. I just did something easy like that. Make sure you bring wool socks. Yes, dress for cold. Um, even though, it's I don't know, it's, it's kind of warm now and it's Hawaii. 
it was below 50 degrees. It was in the probably in the high 30s, maybe low 40s. It was co- and windy. It was Very cold. Windy. Yeah, while you're above, you're above the cloud cover. It was windy. And make sure you use the facilities before you get to the summit. Yeah, definitely. Use the facilities down. Be prepared or prepare with a lot of time. Even even get yourself an extra half an hour from whenever it says because you may want to stop at the bathrooms and then people will fill up the parking lots and then you won't get the top you won't get the ability to go to the top we are up at 10,000 feet where we are standing right now and um, also watch out for either the nene or the nini bird we <laughs> the, will figure that out and get back to you <laughs> the nini bird the, yes <laughs> you're not the, you have to be careful not to hit the nini birds there's a lot of nini bird and cow crossing on your way up here so i wonder how look big, out i wonder how big the nini birds are the um, nini birds have got to be like this big and they run run we across have to the find a nini bird we have to find a nini bird yeah We'll find one. There's one over there. All right, let's go. I don't know what this is, but I really want an image of it. 